Hi, and welcome to the Product Design Show. I'm Allison Topperheim. Imagine if you needed an artificial limb. And I'm Vince Penman. Engineering advances now let people with prosthetics live a very active life. Oscar Pistorius, also known as the Blade Runner, proved that with the right prosthesis, combined with a lot of training and talent, people with prosthetic limbs can compete amongst the top athletes in the world. But how does a person wearing a prosthesis achieve proper walking action or gait? As it turns out, the two key factors are proper fit and alignment. Unfortunately, the force and torsional moments are not static through the stride. This makes the initial setup and alignment of each of the prostheses so critical. The first step in achieving proper alignment is gathering data. So College Park Industries developed a unique wireless sensor and data logging module called the IPEX Lab. The IPEX Lab is mounted between the prosthetic leg and the part of the lower limb that remains, or the residual limb. Using internal strain gauges, the IPEX Lab measures the forces and moments on all three axes. If a force or moment is above the specific threshold while the person is walking, the alignment of the prosthesis can be adjusted in order to improve the gait. We spoke with Mike Lydette, Director of Research at College Park. He explained that this alignment data not only allows for a better fit, it also helps insurance companies by providing quantitative results of the prosthesis function after adjustments to help justify claims. Mike went on to describe that College Park has recently developed another module called the IPEX Pro. Whereas the IPEX Lab has the ability to gather and store data on board and at a higher rate making it ideal for laboratory research purposes, the wireless IPEX Pro was developed for professional prosthetists who fit prostheses on a daily basis. The low profile, lightweight module of the IPEX Pro is as thin as a cell phone. This design parameter is significant because for some single leg prosthesis wearers whose residual leg is relatively long, there isn't enough clearance to fit the larger lab module. College Park faced a design challenge to build the functionality of the IPEX lab into the smaller package. Besides the strain elements and the body itself, engineers had to model the way the electronic flex cables would be routed within the module. Creo Parametric was the CAD software College Park used for the design of the IPEX Pro. You can see Creo Parametric in action by going to ptc.com slash go slash Creo Parametric. If you like the show, please give it a like on Facebook, subscribe on YouTube, or give us a rating on iTunes. And make sure to join us next week to learn about best practices for team collaboration in the design process.